Number 12 then, from Paper 2 of the 2021 Higher Maths Resource Paper, Part A now. The one with the vectors and recurrence relations. So here's the recurrence relations. Now what's I got here? It says, a sequence of real numbers is such that, and there's the recurrence relation that generates the following term, if you know any particular term. One thing to notice here is that multiplying number. That's greater than 1. That's not a proper fraction, so there'll be no limit to this. This is just going to get bigger and bigger and bigger. In fact, it says that in the second part. I don't know if it actually needed to. UN plus 1 is always going to be greater than UN. Well, of course it will, because you're multiplying by something greater than 1. Um, what does it say? The difference between two particular terms is a 1,000. I better put that down then. I'm using a K here for, to identify one of the terms. So, UK plus 1, if you take away UK, because it says the difference between two terms, that comes to a 1,000. So, which term was that? So that it was a 1,000 to get to the following term. You have to determine this algebraically. So, determine algebraically simply means don't just start with some number, try a number, and then see if you can figure that out just by trial and error. Right, three marks. You don't need to because you've got a formula here. What does that say? It's that UK plus 1. How do you get the following term? You take this term and you do this to it. So this term, term here would be 9 lots of the preceding term, that's the UK, the one that I want, minus 440. That minus the UK should be 1,000. You could even emphasize that, I suppose, by putting that a bracket, in a bracket to show it came from there. Right, what oh, was two marks there? You got one mark for realising that that was referring to the subtraction here. When it said the difference, it meant you actually subtracted them. And then there's one mark for replacing that with its equivalent, which mentions the previous term, so there's only one unknown. And then when you solve that, well, that leaves eight. You've got eight lots of UK. That'll come across and add and make 1440. So here's UK. UK is going to be... 1440 upon 8. And then 8 goes into that 1, that's 64, 180 times. So UK must be 180.